hello friends in this video I will show you the method or uh, uh, to memorize uh, 20 cross 20 tables in uh, at the most 10 days or let's say two weeks so uh, you can also do it in one week you know if you are pretty much interested so uh, uh, this is the 11 cross 20 tables I uh, you know just tapped on the excel so uh, as you can see the red ones are the squares you know 12 cross 12 13 cross 13 14 cross 14 and the numbers on this side are the have their mirror image on this side okay so if, you know 221 is here 221 is also here so uh, uh, this is the pretty much the tough part of the 20 cross 20 tables you know so uh, mm, you know I have memorized all this in you know 10 days so it, it was pretty easy once you know how to do that so uh, the thing is that you know uh, I told my friend to ask me random questions so uh, uh, that way I had a better uh, you know grip on the tables but that pissed off my friend too so uh, what I did was I write I wrote a a small code in C++ which asks me a random questions and I answer it so uh, even with uh, half an hour practice daily I could memorize all these tables so uh, that's how we can do it I'll show you how to run that code and I have uploaded that code and given the link in the below description so uh, let's see first you'll have to download the C++ setup which I have already downloaded you know so um, the link is provided in the description so you know you can just install the C++ you know it's a big it's a, just a 3 MB software so if you are using Windows XP it will also work so that's how you start it I'll just scale down the box so you can see what I'm doing okay so here is the C++ and then you can just you know make a new file and oops this one new file and save it as for let's say XYZ save the name of XYZ okay uh, yes it won't appear on your computer but I had already a file name XYZ so I did it so uh, that's how you uh, create a new file and then just you know close it and then download the text file that I have uploaded in the second link below so I have already uh, downloaded that link already you know this is the text file I have already downloaded you can copy the whole code control C and then just you know go to your my computer just C drive go to DC go to bin and then go to the file XYZ you know XYZ here yeah. so on the XYZ open the open in a notepad format and just paste the code type save close it and On the other window, also there are there will be two files X Y Z. So do the same thing on both the files. Okay. So now we are done. So now run the C plus plus again. I'll minimize it again. So yeah. Now you can just open the X Y Z okay so your code is finally here so now to run this you can press control F9 okay so now the code has started okay so now it will ask me to enter a single table or a range so what this thing is uh, really is in single table it will ask you from you know if you enter any number let's say uh, 14 so it will ask you uh, the number of questions you can write okay 10 questions and it will ask you in the range of 14 cross 1 to 14 cross 10 okay 
1 to 1, 14 cross 1 to 14 cross 1. You can just answer it, okay, cool. You know, you can answer anything. I'm just entering any random number, okay. So, you know, I know all the answers, okay. <laughs> so, you know, you can answer it. And then, uh, in the range thing, what you can do is it will ask you the questions ranging from 11 to 20 you know if 14 cross 11 to 14 cross 20 and in the range also you can uh, have questions from different tables also so like if you enter a number of questions of 30 let's say and enter the lower and upper limits of the table so if you enter 13 as the lower and 14 as the upper limit so it will ask you questions from 13 cross 11 to 14 cross 20 okay so in this table I am just going to enter both the limits at 16 so it will ask me questions from 16 cross 11 to 16 cross 20 so let's say 206 208 uh, 288 you know 272 272 you know 240 208 uh, a bit nervous okay so I'm slowing down that's 300 and four two forty two eighty eight two to six the questions will get repeated you know but they are random okay so uh, that's because you have you have entered uh, thirty questions and it will ask you mm, uh, ten questions you, you, you maximum times uh, it will uh that you have entered 30 questions and it will ask out of 10 questions so questions are bound to be repeated you know but the thing is that uh, the questions uh, the randomness of the question depends on the time you take to answer them so if you answer too quickly uh, at the same time there are chances that questions might get repeated you know too often you see but in the end you can you know do with much better speed and accuracy and see it will show you that you have scored you know the correct answers upon the total answers and the time taken is 84 seconds so you know you can do it in like 60 seconds per table I, yeah, I could do it and then for the whole range you can do it in 100 seconds so that's very good speed and you know it will help you in indirectly in many exams and all so I hope you liked it and uh, thank you for watching and do subscribe